And um, Corla, Minister, road safety is something that every member of this House is acutely concerned about. As we head into the bank holiday weekend, we are all thinking of the 155 lives lost on Irish roads um, since the start of this year, which is unfortunately an increase of 36 on this time last year. And indeed, my thoughts are with all of those families today. On the point of fatalities, Minister, I want to mention the section of the N67 in Clare. This road sees a high volume of traffic every day, a mix of both commuters from Clare, uh, between Clare and Galway, and also tourist traffic to areas like the Burn and the Cliffs of Moher in one direction, and down to Lahinch, Doombeg and Kilkee in the other. I also want to highlight the N68, Minister, running between Ennis and Kilrush through Lizzie Casey. Both of these roads require serious investment, and the N68, Minister, is actually above the national average with respect to the rate of injuries on the road versus just material collision. I want to take the opportunity to acknowledge Gerry O'Connor. May he rest in peace. He was killed in August at the Bally Canoe Road outside Ballyvaughan. Unfortunately, he was the fifth serious accident on this part of the road, and so it's viewed locally as a black spot, and we need to see a significant reduction of speed. I spoke to his amazing wife, Helga, who has been so brave in speaking out since about this issue, and she mentioned that in Denmark, for example, they've reduced speed to 30 kilometres in towns and villages, and can that be looked at? for there. Um, this area has a playground, a church and a health centre there too, Minister, and I'd like to also take this opportunity to formally invite you down to this area um, just to see the environment of this road, Minister. You might come back in your response on that. Finally, Minister, I want to note that I was disappointed to see the current expenditure for the, the department will be down by 2% next year. In view of all of the talking points um, on road safety in recent months, I raised roads fundings for local authorities with the Taoiseach a few months ago and he pointed to the significant significant increase in inflation and also the reduction in funding um, and how that's going to have a knock-on effect for a market.